This is the raid buff status dashboard. It will automatically open when you join a raid or a party. It is split into several different areas. The top area automatically has things that you might consider to be a warning, such as someone AFK. Beneath that we have got raid status bars. Beneath that we have the buffs that you might use on trash, you know, things like spirit, the main sort of raiding buffs. And then beneath that we've got the, the buffs that you would use when you're doing a, a boss encounter, things like food, flasks and so on. The little numbers on the, the buttons have got different meanings. The colour gives you some information. Yellow just means that someone is missing something. Red means that you yourself are missing something or are responsible for uh, casting a buff that needs to be cast. Blue means that you're missing something that somebody else is responsible for casting. In addition, each of the buffs on the dashboard you can left click to enable and disable. If you shift click on a buff it will report to the raid or the party only that buff that's missing. If you control click on a buff, it will whisper those who need to do the buff. If you alt click or right click on a self buff or indeed on a party buff, it will cast it for you. So this is what it looks like when you press the trash button. You can see it reports to raid what's missing. If you click boss, it reports everything on the dashboard, not just the warning buffs. That's shift clicking, showing just the one single missing or warning buff. And if you hold down control, you see it will automatically whisper the person. Who needs to do the buff. Of course in this case it was myself and so therefore there's a double whisper there. 